as the mother of the nation, I want you to know that we love you. We are proud of each one of you and we want the best for you all. We want you to excel in your life and grow up to become productive members of the community. I want you to take advantage of your access to education to lay the foundation for a brighter tomorrow. We have seen many children and learners create lasting impact in their communities because they were committed and focused on their education. One such child from this county is Johnson Mwawasi who grew up in a humble family in Chala Ward. When he sat for his KCP exams, he was top of the class and he joined Kenyatta High School, Mwatate, where he was the top, the top student in Taita Taveta in 2002. He joined Strathmore University through a scholarship from East Africa Breweries to study for a Bachelor of Commerce degree. Because of his education, Johnson is a leading infrastructure advisor across Africa and was appointed by His Excellency Governor Andrew Mwadime as a director of the Taita Taveta Investment and Development Corporation. He has also invested back at home by setting up the first hotel in Chalawad, employing over 10 people from the local community. The Bible in Proverbs chapter 1 verses 8 to 9 reminds you to always respect and obey your parents. And I quote, listen, my son and my daughter, to your father's instructions and do not forsake your mother's teaching. They are a garland to grace your head and a chain to adorn your neck. Colossians chapter 3 verses 20 says, and I quote, children, Obey your parents in everything, for this pleases the Lord. Learners, ladies and gentlemen, as we celebrate this day, I ask every stakeholder present to take it as a personal responsibility to care for and nurture our children. Let us develop interventions that can address the challenges at hand. Every child, regardless of their gender, social economic background, or geographical location has the right to a quality life. We must protect our children from any threat of abuse. Let us leverage the toll-free national child helpline number 116 to report any cases of violence against children. Let us leverage technology to bring education to the most remote corners of our country. Let us foster partnerships with non-governmental organizations, the private sector, and international bodies to enhance our educational infrastructure. I wish to close with a quote from Kofi Annan, who once said, and I quote, education is the great equalizer of our time. It gives hope to the hopeless and creates chances for those without. Together, we can create a, high, a brighter future for our children, for they are our heritage and our treasure. Thank you, and may the good Lord bless you. Thank you, our children. Thank you, everybody. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you very much.